is the data skewed left, sometimes called negatively, right or skewed positively, or is it skewed not at all? The skewness, the classic picture that you'll see of skewness for skewed left is this graph. It looks like a normal distribution that's skewed, that is pulled over. So it looks kind of like this, where you've got the bulk of the data over here, but there are some low numbers pulling, pulling the mean to the left. So that's skewed left. Something that would be skewed right then kind of looks like an, a mirror of that. So I'll just draw a little picture for you. Most of the data is bulked up here, but then something is pulling it. Something is, is pulling it over to the, to the right. You've got a few high values, so this would be skewed positively or to the right. You can also have this not at all. So you could say that the data is symmetrical if, if you have this look of the data. So you've got the, uh, the bulk of the data right around the, the mean. Okay, we can also talk about um, this with numerical, right? These are nice uh, graph um, visual representations of, of data being skewed. But let's talk about uh, numerically what this means. Well, if it's skewed left, then the mean is being pulled over because the mean considers all numbers, whereas the median just looks at the middle position number. So the mean is less than the median when data is skewed left. And you guessed it, if it's skewed right, the mean is greater than the median. So you've got some, you could think of, think of it as you've got some typical numbers that the median would represent these typical numbers, something up here. But uh, you've got some very high numbers, or at least even one number, that's pulling the mean, the arithmetic mean, to the right, or positively. Symmetrical. Symmetrical, yes, can you guess it? The mean equals the median. Right on target. Now, after all that, let's answer the question, is this data over here, skewed left, right, or not at all? Let's see. Let's find the mean. In Excel, that is equals average, A-V-E, A-G-E. -E. Or, of course, you can find that on the F of X button. Equals average of what? I open up the parentheses, and then I choose all of this data, and then close the parentheses. We're good. By the way, just <laughs> it just uh, occurred to me that a lot of times... Um, students will say, hey, it's not working. They forget that equal sign. So remember that equal sign before your commands. Or, of course, you can always use this function key, and, and you're fine with that. So equals. It is median for this one. Equals median. Open up the parentheses. Choose it all. Close the parentheses. You've got the median. Right away, we know that this is skewed left. So because, because the mean of... 54.7 is less than the median of 58, we say that this is skewed left or skewed negatively. So that negative does not mean that we have negative numbers. It just means that it's going to the left. So skewed left. Our data is skewed left. And I just wanted to show you also uh, the skewness. You can get a skewness, a numerical measurement of skewness, and it's going to give you a positive or a negative number, so left or right, by just hit going into function or just typing in equals skew. It's not skewness. It's just equals skew. Open up the parentheses, data, and then you have a quick answer. Is it left or right? It is negative, negative skewness. So that is a skewed left data set.